What's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on how to merge objects into Cinema 4D. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your browser and you're going to type in turbosquid.com. I know it's a weird name but it works really good. Now once you're here, TurboSquid, you're going to go over here and you're going to register for an account. It's free. You just register. I think you confirm your email, whatever. You've done that before. And then uh, once you log in, you're going to go over here to the search bar and search something for your logo that you want. Say, if you want a grenade for your logo, maybe. So you search grenade. And then uh, now up here, you want to change your preferences. Make sure this is at lower prices. Uh, because that way when you search um, all these are free up here and uh, as you get farther down they're gonna start costing you money like um, these ones are eight bucks ten bucks twelve bucks they keep getting more expensive so you want the free ones up top so you know when to stop scrolling down um, you can mess with the other stuff too to make it thumbnails bigger if you want um, now once you have this page you're gonna find a good grenade that you want these ones look pretty good just click on it and uh, make sure it's compatible with Cinema 4D like you want once you see these pictures up here you can check them out see if you like it click download up here and uh, this will bring you to my files which is um, all the objects that you've downloaded and uh, now you're gonna click the one that's compatible with Cinema 4D right here just click this download over here it's done downloading and uh, once you open it you're gonna want to extract it too and uh, you can extract it to your desktop if you want and move it to a file later I already have a file in mind so I'm just gonna bring that over there weapons okay and then just click yes to all and then once you're done with that you're gonna open up cinema go to file merge not open go to merge and then you're gonna go to where you saved it and uh, open it up and there you go um, you it, uh, a lot of objects come with stuff like there's a floor over here already you can just take that out comes with a light you can take that out um, and the objects too you can expand them and they have other they have separate parts but I just like to keep those closed unless you want to really take something out but I usually don't um, so you can go ahead and render that um, if you add a light in here you can see it better um, yeah that looks pretty good but yeah guys there you go that's your uh, importing objects to Cinema 4D tutorial Hope you enjoyed, uh, comment, rate, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, let me know if you want me to do another tutorial involving Cinema 4D.